us. Now, the BJP's infighting today split wide open and became public. The party's three MPs in the Public Accounts Committee, the PAC, did not attend the PAC meeting today, which was chaired by their expelled colleague, Mr. Jaswan Singh. In fact, the whole occasion became another excuse for a slanging match between the party and Mr. Jaswan Singh. I am continuing because uh, I do not accept the dictatorship of any political party and because the only authority that can ask me to leave the committee is the Speaker of the House. Today, I am going to say that the Speaker has given 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 the party के कहने से नहीं छोड़ेंगे ये तर्क सही नहीं है इट्स द बीजेपीज वॉ पार्लियामेंट इज अ बैटल ग्राउंड जसवंत सिंह टुडे इग्नोर द बीजेपीज प्लीज एंड कॉल द फर्स्ट मीटिंग ऑफ द पब्लिक अकाउंट्स कमेटी इन टर्न द बीजेपी बॉयकॉटेड द मीट यशवंत सिन्हा चोज टू बी इन झारखंड गोपीनाथ मुंडे बैटल द पुलिस इन मुंबई एंड शांता कुमार वाज इन दिल्ली बट स्टेड होम डेफिनेटली इम्पोर्टेंट कमेटी लेकिन कोई और इतना जरूरी काम हो तो कई बार मिस करना पड़ता है Jaswan Singh is not about to give in. The Speaker can remove him only if he fails to perform as PAC chairman. And Jaswan's first PAC meeting was eventful. Five subcommittees were set up to look into 35 subjects. Since Jaswan Singh is covering his bases, the BJP is desperate. The Public Accounts Committee of Parliament is like a super auditor. In the end, Jaswan Singh may win or the BJP may have its way. But who will be accountable for this unsavory skirmish? The BJP needs to do an internal audit. In Delhi, Rahul Shivastav for NTV.